guys, we have only 10 minutes stop here in Copi Pili. And this is the famous island where Leonardo DiCaprio movie, The Beach, been shot. We are traveling Thailand in the low season for two weeks now. So far we have benefited from less tourist crowds and mostly dry weather. Mostly. On the other hand, we got places like Emerald Cave in Koh Lantan that was closed for the low season. Let's hope that in the next island nothing will be closed because this one I've been waiting for so long. Hello guys and welcome to Kofi Fi. We have just arrived in a speedboat from Kolanta to Kofi Fi, a half hour speed run. And we have bad news and good news. The bad news is that uh, no electricity till 5 in all island. And the good news is uh, that our hotel, the Kabul Beach, upgraded our room for free and we received a beautiful view on the bay. We decided to make kayaking because we don't have uh, big plans for today. And hopefully we'll find some uh, spot for snorkeling and uh, maybe that uh, beach of monkeys. Hello! <laughs> Snorkel here in the monkey beach and the snorkel here the corals are in amazing amazing condition yeah and so many fish it's so many fish so much yeah. maybe it's a, the best spot we snorkel so far in Thailand and now we want to search maybe we'll find some monkeys <laughs> the water level got reduced, so as you can see, all the coast of Kofi Pi, all the all the stones on the surface come uh, up from the water. You can see the boats over there standing on the on the sand. <laughs> wow, this is ridiculous. We can have a walk to our hotel from the water. Inside the water. Inside the water. Yeah. It is over there. Good morning guys, today is our first uh, full day here in Coffee Pea and we decided why not look all around the island. So we booked a full day trip of snorkeling with up to 9 stops all around the island including Bamboo Island, Mosquito Island and uh, Kopi Li. Unfortunately the Maya Bay will be closed because it's September, it opens in November. Prices of, of the tour is uh, 600 baht which is around uh, 17 dollars. And in addition to that, you need to pay an uh, entrance fee for a national park, which is 400 per person. And altogether, it's all $28 per person. Not far from the port, we already got to do our first stop for snorkeling. This rock in the middle of the nowhere. Our second stop in this tour is Bamboo Island. It is 12 o'clock, but uh, it's too early for, for our lunch because we started at 10 o'clock and we are fin scheduled to finish at 7. We are uh, looking uh, around the island, maybe we'll find some beach to snorkel. We got lunch and we're gonna eat on the boat. Let's see what we got. It's a uh, rice with uh, vegetables and chicken. We have arrived to this beautiful lagoon in Kofi Pi Li. And we only got 10 minutes over here. So we got limited time to get photos. There's no corals around. So the, the, the fish the they just eat us instead <laughs> yeah they're just biting us in the legs a really biting not a yeah, small not a one link. it's like a real bite <laughs> real bite so don't stand too much in one place <laughs> yeah. we got to the famous maya bay well it's the low season and you cannot step on the on the Maya Bay beach on September, but at least I, I got to the beach just in front of Maya Bay. Take a look. <laughs> we got another last stop 
here in the bay of uh, Kopipi and we found some monkey over there. Let's take a look. The full day trip was amazing with nine stops of snorkeling, but the best part was the coffee fee lee which also included in the half day trip. So if you party all night and wake up afternoon, the half day trip is the best choice for you. Good morning guys and what a beautiful morning to wake up to a view like this. This is the view from our bed. In today's video, we're just going to have a walk around coffee fee. Guys, some thoughts about uh, Copy P. Of course, everything you see in the pictures and Google and stuff, of course, all the views are amazing and they're just amazing in the real life. But uh, in the streets and the pathways behind the buildings, it's uh, lots, lots of garbage, lots of waste. It's a backyard that you don't see in the videos. The streets in Copy P are so narrow that there are no cars, no motorcycles. People use wagons to deliver everything they need, if it's luggage for the hotel or uh, supply to the tours. So uh, make sure to book a hotel uh, near the pier or make sure the hotel uh, have a wagon to deliver the luggage. Say hello! Hello! <laughs> hello to the world! Hello to you too! Hello! Nice to meet you guys! Nice to meet you, nice to meet you too! Meet you. A quick tip for you guys! If you see a restaurant or, or a hotel with uh, the letters SHA, it means uh, safety and health uh, administration gave them a certificate for uh, hygiene uh, regulations. Uh, so it's uh, safe to eat there. We bought a banana luti, which is, uh, by the way, very delicious. And uh, we're, we've been walking here in the alley, on the street, and suddenly Karina noticed uh, monkeys. Now, monkeys when they say see food they will fight you to death until they get the food they so will, just run away yeah they will do everything to get the food so, so they are here let's go oh, <laughs> oh my, my god let's run <laughs> <laughs> so Karina noticed and ran away she reacted very quickly something that we saw here in Thailand that in every district or street on the street lamps you can see some symbol that uh, represents the area for instance here in uh, Koh Phi Phi you can see the sword fishes in uh, Koh Tao we saw the uh, turtles and uh, in the floating market we saw the boat some hotels are located in remote places where you can reach only by boat but now when uh, low tide people just walking down there and now before the sunset we are trying to get to the viewpoint I hope we are not too late I need you with me by my 